Hello, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Floss A Plays Dover's Drop. This probably will be the last episode of the alpha build. The beta build is set to launch, but uh, until it does, I'm going to do this episode, and it should be the next episode. We will be in the beta build. All new playlist, all new. All new VA, all new everything, uh, for the most part, it sounds like. So, uh, looking forward to that. I wanted to win a, a round, or at least have a better chance. So I am going to go with the rogue today. And I've said this before, uh, if you go to the forums, there is a guide on how to play. And it, it's a fairly good good guide is for the alpha uh, for the beta build that hasn't come out yet but you know what I'm about to say kind of pertains to every version knowing how the the enemies interact with you and your surroundings is probably the biggest thing you can do to improve your game the other the next biggest thing is picking up items when you're not really Needing them, or, or health, I should say, not items necessarily. Um, it's a shame that I took damage, the first thing I took damage on was, you know, not an enemy. But that's okay. There we go, took some damage on an enemy. But yeah, that's, that's definitely what I would say is my first bit of advice. Understand how enemies interact with you on a fundamental level. Plan your movements accordingly. Knowledge, knowledge is power, as they say. Ah, oh, I hate you, fighter. I hate you so much. Uh, saw some new enemies with, that will be coming in. Who knows when? But very, very, very excited, all things considered. A lot of different uh, bat versions. I saw a more adult... Oh, we're gonna, yep, take damage. Uh, saw a more adult version of the... Goblin. Apologies. I, mean. I hate you so much, spider. Run away. Luckily, there's a lot of help sitting around. Run away. Uh, in the main room, so we should be okay. Taking a lot of damage on this floor. Um, all of a sudden. Alright. I'm definitely better with the rogue than I am with the gladiator. I just, I prefer faster characters and faster attacking. Oop. Don't fall into the void. Uh, faster attacking characters, all, to, all things said and done. So, I'm looking forward to playing the other classes. Other caster type classes were mentioned uh, in the live stream, the art live stream. And they, ooh, yes, full health. I will take that. Thank you. And another shield. So, we are back. Uh, always leave the center room, or, you know, uh, the room with the most health. Always leave that for last. Try to get by on residual health pickups if you can, and don't pick up health when you don't need it. Man manage that and you'll have... I've not seen this layout before. This is great. I love that. Alright, that was all of them. Yeah, the, the, the less health you pick up over time, the better. Handle rates are, are really straightforward. Go go for the source. They, they bear little mention, I think, personally. Don't focus on the small stuff. You know, focus on the big stuff. And you should be okay. Uh, sucks that it's a dead end. I was hoping for a fast run, but 
but that may not be in the cards. See there, I picked up a health piece when I shouldn't have. I don't think that's gonna bite us in the ass. I hope it doesn't bite us in the ass. But you never know for these things. Dynamic lighting's coming. Oh my goodness. And ghosts won't shoot at you until you are in their range. And they're fairly easy to, to kind of dodge. Because their, their attacks won't... Their attacks don't deviate. They go in a straight line. I don't know if they're in a linear line, but that's, you know stupid so I won't say it oh for God's sakes I hate slimes in this room generally they're not so bad get away oh I like that Boom. Boom. yeah this is a good feeling Pretty sure, yep, dead end, so. Wait. Oh. Well, that shield piece is dead to us. Alright. Only leaves us one direction. Not like that crappy band. I try to keep my personal opinions to myself so as not to you know, alienate my listener base, but I think it's fairly safe to. Ooh, fuck you, spider. Uh, didn't man, didn't know that you were there. Uh, spiders are are pretty easy to to get around with stuff in the way. Always keep obstacles in front of you so that they can't just pounce you right in the face. Ah, see? Picking up health. Not good. Run. Die, you piece of crap. I am taking a lot of stupid damage. Something's still alive. It's a bat. Oh, and there's also a uh, rat running around. Come here, you. Lucky bat. Right. Oh. Don't touch me. Awesome. Okay. I just like ranged classes. I'm, I, I don't know. I really, really want to play the Musketeer. Wow, what a straight line that we've got going on here. Run. Ah, yay, trigger room. Okay. Oh, there we go. Doing a fairly quick run. I'd like to think. I've explored a lot of, a lot of the level. But that's okay. <laughs> I I enjoy it. But yeah, th this game is designed with backtracking in mind, so never feel like you're backtracking too much. I, th I think that's the best advice I could give anybody, really. Even more so than... You know, learn the, the habits and the movements of your enemies. Uh, peace and for victory will, will come your way with that. It's good advice, I'd like to think. I think it goes without saying for any kind of game like this. Knowing how enemies and entities will behave is always a safe... Always a safe bet. Third floor. <clears throat> feels like we've been doing this for about ten minutes, so... This will probably be a regular size length run. Unless I die. And it's possible because there's a lot of ghosts and spiders on this. Ah, yes. Oh, 
almost did damage. I hate you, bats. Plenty of doors here, so. Just once I'd like the door, the trigger room, not to be on the top. Nope, nope, ah! Was not fast enough. Or right, was too fast. I'm gonna sneeze. Hey, At some point, I knew it was coming. Apologies. Apologies. Ow. A lot of, uh, ways out. Oh, nice. Not getting that. That shield piece is dead to me. We'll be able to, uh, block with our shield in the next update as well, I'm pretty sure. Oh. Awesome. That's... This is awesome. I love it. Run away. Down, down to Goblin Town. Let's do this. And down to the fourth floor we go after we heal up. See, it, already my my run is much improved by not having to rely on the center room until the very end. Which is a problem with the last two runs. I was relying on the center room for my health a little too much at the start of the run. Of the, the floor, as opposed to the end of the floor. And you just can't do that. Just can't do that. Fourth floor is usually the biggest. I, we're, we got real lucky that we found the trigger room so swiftly. And I'm not banking on it being this way, but... Goblins are probably the most erratic of me. Oh, see? Picking up health when I shouldn't be. Uh, don't, don't, uh, don't follow what I do, follow what I say. Also, time your attacks a little bit better, Wa, if you could. even a pathway. Ooh. Nice! This is a unique, or I should say rare layout, I wouldn't say unique, but... Ah, oh, darn, no keys. Okay. Never seen that room before. See, there's still stuff that I haven't seen even though I've played a lot. Um, there we go. We actually did need that, I think. No? Maybe not. I don't know. I'm not uh, paying attention to my health as well as I should. And you know, running into enemies. Oh, get away! Yeah, I was gonna say, I'm gonna take damage from that. See, had I not picked up those two health potions when I did need them, F you, ghost, uh, we wouldn't be in nearly as bad a spot. But that's okay. <clears throat> Could be worse. Do not hit the big exploding box, Va. These are just some, you know, things that you can tell yourself. And this is it at end. So that's okay. We we made really, really, really good time on the last area. Awesome. So, we should be a-okay. Ah, see? Picked up that health again. Can't, can't keep doing that, Vaw. Want a successful run. And ideally, you, ideally, you want not to break even on health, but gain health. I was really hoping for an easy find. That doesn't look like it's gonna be in the cards, unless we get really lucky. And so far we've actually been fairly lucky on this run. 
really, I was really excited because this is the general shape of the trigger room. Oh. Yes, okay. Thought for whoop, for sure, that we take damage on that. Ah, oh, I dodged right into that. Ha, I love it. Don't shoot, don't shoot, don't shoot, don't shoot. I would like to see enemies go after one another when they take damage from one another. I think that'd be that's really the only other thing I, I'd want to see that's not in the game right now, or that I, I I know for a fact I don't I don't think it's planned. I'm fairly certain it's not actually in the cards, but I would like to see it because I think it's more realistic. I know there will be. NPCs in the game, and I, I'm pretty sure I will actually be an NPC in the game since I did back the game to that tier. But I might be misremembering tier uh, options, so. Trigger room, yeah! Alright. Fast run today. It feels, de it sure, sure feels fast. Just gonna get down to the bottom, and we're not gonna be at full health, but that's okay. And down one, down one, and then over one. <laughs> Fairly good pathfinding skills today, and uh, yeah, successful run is successful. That's all I care about. Uh, as always, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks for watching.